Dr. Pete Esterbrook here. Today we're going to talk about lip therapy. So, of course, we want to set ourselves up so that we avoid damaging our lips internally or externally. So, we want to go about that by uh, making sure that we're hydrated, of course, first and foremost, uh, avoiding direct sun contact, if at all possible, and not using excessive uh, mouthpiece or left arm pressure and of course building endurance. However, there are times when it's unavoidable um, that we're going to get a, an internal or an external sore on the lip or the tissue around the lips. One of the main things we can do to promote circulation and healing is just the basic flutter. In the extreme case of swelling, you can use uh, a pack of cold peas. Um, or a cold pack, a wash rag is also your friend. Um, put that under hot water, uh, as hot as you can stand it, and then lay that over your chops. And you can alternate that uh, with the cold pack, hot, cold, hot, cold, and that'll tend to bring down uh, swelling. There are several products on the market. Um, for various types of uh, external uh, lip and tissue issues. Of course, there's a uh, chop saver, which works better than uh, Chapstick or Blistex, Carmex, Burt's Bees, in my opinion. It's all natural products. It doesn't tend to uh, make a problem if you put it on and then put the mouthpiece on to play. I, I think it's really fine for that. There's also the Robinson Remedy Lip Renew and Lip uh, Restore. Uh, each of them have a different purpose. One is for actual cold sores. The Lip Renew is just more a revitalizing uh, you'll get a little tingling from that, and um, it, it can help um, extend your endurance if you're on a, a long uh, gig and, and playing for a long period of time. It can help keep you revitalized. One of my personal favorite products is uh, Tropical Traditions. This is just coconut oil. There's nothing else in it. I like it when I start to feel a little chapped. And again, just similar to the Chop Saver, I can put it on my lips and, and immediately play. I don't have any problem with it caking up on the mouthpiece or making things feel strange. Uh, for internal uh, mouth sores, so in other words, uh, maybe you have a, a tooth like I do. I don't generally have this problem, but some students tend to have a problem where that tooth will cut into their lip if they're playing for a long period of, of time, particularly using pressure at the wrong angle or excessive pressure. One product that seems to help a little bit is this Oral Gel Extreme PM. Um, you can put that on your lip. It's got a high concentration of benzocaine, 20%. That's the highest any of the products that I've seen. Uh, and it'll tend to deaden, so you can get a good night's rest without it uh, sort of throbbing on you. Um, if you need to get through a rehearsal or immediately after a rehearsal, uh, just deadening that little surface where the problem is uh, 
could could be helpful. Also, students that have braces, maybe they're getting poked by their braces. That that could be a, a product that could be helpful for them. Um, the dental wax tends to not not work all that well, but um, oral oral be extreme. Yeah. Possible solution for internal mouth sores or tenderness in an area would be to uh, swish around some warm salt water several times a day throughout the day.